Can happiness be measured, and if so, can it be improved? The World Happiness Report aims to measure the state of global happiness. A groundbreaking survey started in 2012 and released at the United Nations International Day of Happiness, it uses six key drivers in measuring happiness. Family, freedom, generosity, trust, health, and economy. The survey data reveals the current state of happiness around the world for a given year. For example, we are easily able to see concentrations of happiness from 2015 and observe moderate shifts during 2016 and again observe shifts during 2017. By looking at the top rankings in a single driver, interesting observations are seen. For example, looking at economy alone, the United States will rank as the number one happiest country in the world. However, the data shows that in 2015, the U.S. ranked number 15, moving up to number 13 in 2016 and back down to number 14 in 2017. Whereas, Switzerland ranked number 1 in 2015, Denmark number 1 in 2016, and Norway number 1 in 2017. The survey results demonstrates the varying nature of the global state of happiness and shows that factors such as the preservation of nature contribute to the happiness in the case of Norway. Other factors such as the country's social and cultural climate or even lifestyles and values contribute to the overall happiness of a country. The World Happiness Report shows we are able to measure happiness on a global scale and offers a rich data set to allow countries and governments to explore happiness and its drivers in a way not possible before the report. If it could be measured, then it could be improved, and efforts to improve now can be assessed by government. To explore the Happiness Report, visit happiness.report or follow them on Facebook and Twitter.